I thought at the minute he entered the business that Jay-Z would be a formidable presence in the Asian industry. He is a draw, and I've heard from the Asian community that they're worried. Certainly from our competitor standpoint, they've got to be concerned. Jay-Z and Rock Nation bring a lot to the party. He's got reach to places that probably are different than, than what typically CAA is involved in. It comes down to two things, the ability to recruit players and the ability to deliver the contract. As a recruiter, I give him an A+. He's done a pretty superb job of picking players that can trigger multiple revenue streams. They are good for contract negotiations, they are good for endorsements, they're good for crossover entertainment projects. He's got the starting quarterback of a New York football team. Durant is there for marketing. CC, he's got a starting pitcher for the New York Yankees. It doesn't get a whole lot better than that. In terms of negotiating, I don't think he negotiates the contracts. With guys who are well established and experienced in the business backing him up, there's no limit as to what he can do. I am confident that there are more players recruiting Jay-Z than vice versa. Are they overselling? I'm going to get you in videos or getting mo movies or music? Perhaps. But there's an entree there that can be used. My sense is they won't change the business. <laughs> uh, they'll make an impact. Uh, one of the earliest pieces of advice I, I ever got in this business was from Dean Smith. It was not to worry about your competition. And I asked him about his rivalry with Duke. He said he never focused on that. It was just about you know, doing what he thought was right for North Carolina. And that's how I view our business.